Although chlorine has been used sporadically to purify water since the 1850s, little was understood about the cleansing process, and using the chemical for water purification remained dangerous. In the early 1900s, cities across America were expanding at a rapid pace, and luxuries such as indoor running water were becoming more widespread. With no safe or effective measures to clean their drinking water, city water suppliers often became unwitting disseminators of an array of diseases, including cholera, dysentery, and typhoid. This is where Woolman and Inslow enter our story. Born in Baltimore, Maryland in 1892, Abel Woolman studied engineering at Johns Hopkins University. Here, Woolman met Lynn Inslow, a chemistry student from Richmond, Virginia. After graduating, the pair began working at the Maryland Department of Public Health. They teamed up to study water purification in 1918, taking into account acidity, bacterial content, and taste. Inslow and Woolman created a standard formula to determine the amount of chlorine needed to purify water supplies in 1923. Inslow and Woolman's rigorous scientific research laid the foundation for water purification across the world. Woolman actively encouraged U.S. states and other countries to adopt the formula. When they did, the rates of many diseases dropped spectacularly. By 1941, 85% of all U.S. water systems used the Inslow-Woolman formula. The rest of the world followed America's lead. Thanks to the work of Inslow and Woolman, billions of people now have access to safe drinking water. It is estimated that the adoption of their formula in water systems worldwide has saved almost 200 million lives. It is for this reason that Lynn Inslow and Abel Woolman are our 16th Heroes of Progress.